we want to find the first order partial derivatives of the given function f of x comma y. Let's first write the function f of x comma y using a rational exponent where we can write the square root as an exponent of one half. So the given function is f of x comma y equals four times the quantity five x cubed plus four y plus eight x y to the fifth raised to the power of positive one half. In order to find the partial derivatives, we will have to apply the chain rule where the inner function is five x cubed plus four y plus eight x y to the fifth, which we will call u. So now we can think of the given function as just four u to the one half, where again u is equal to the inner function of five x cubed plus four y plus eight x y to the fifth. To find the partial of f with respect to x, we consider y a constant and differentiate with respect to x. So again, thinking of the function as four u to the one half, the derivative with respect to x is going to be four times one half times u to the power of one half minus one, which is an exponent of negative one half times u prime. So u to the power of negative one half is the quantity five x cubed plus four y plus eight x y to the fifth raised to the power of negative one half. And then to find u prime, we differentiate five x cubed plus four y plus eight x y to the fifth with respect to x, treating y as a constant. So we have times the derivative of five x cubed with respect to x is 15 x squared. Because we're treating y as a constant, the derivative of four y with respect to x is zero and then we have plus the derivative of eight x y to the fifth with respect to x treating y to the fifth as a constant. And since the derivative of eight x with respect to x is eight, we have plus eight y to the fifth. And now let's multiply and write the partial derivative using positive exponents. Remember if we move the quantity five x cubed plus four y plus eight x y to the fifth raised to the power of negative one half, down to the denominator, it will change the exponent to positive one half. So in the numerator we have four times one half, which is two, times the quantity 15 x squared plus eight y to the fifth. In the denominator, we are going to have this quantity raised to the power of one half, which is equivalent to the square root. So let's write the denominator as the square root of the quantity five x cubed plus four y plus eight x y to the fifth. And now to find the partial of f with respect to y, we consider x a constant and differentiate with respect to y. So again, thinking of the function in terms of u, we need to differentiate four u to the power of one half with respect to y, treating x as a constant. So we're still gonna have four times one half times u to the power of one half minus one, which gives us the quantity five x cubed plus four y plus eight x y to the fifth, raised to the power of negative one half, and then times u prime, where now u prime is the derivative of five x cubed plus four y plus eight x y to the fifth, with respect to y, treating x as a constant. And therefore the derivative of five x cubed with respect to y is equal to zero, because we're treating x as a constant, plus the derivative of four y with respect to y is four, so we have times the quantity four plus the derivative of eight x y to the fifth with respect to y, treating x as a constant. So we multiply by five, which gives us 40, giving us 40 x y to the power of four. So again, let's go ahead and multiply and write the partial derivative using a positive exponent. In the numerator we have four times one half, which is two, times the quantity four plus 40 x y to the fourth. And again, moving the negative exponent down to the denominator, the exponent becomes positive one half, which is equivalent to the square root. So we have the square root of the quantity five x cubed plus four y plus eight x y to the fifth in the denominator. I hope you found this helpful.